welcome to episode 9, Extra YT Checks. This is the last kid left in the woods podcast. Merry Christmas, create us here. Welcome back. Doing as many as I can. Back to back recordings. Because as I've been sharing, I'm going for real, for real, off grid soon. And I'm going to be working on all sorts of cover versions of songs, plus my own. And, well, I'm not going to list off all the activities I have planned. It's way too many. It would take hours. <laughs> That's only a slight exaggeration. Okay, so I got two songs that keep popping through my head. Yeah, everybody wear a mask, but how long will it last is one. And the second one is someone I saw live who's one of my favorites once again. And my favorites have changed quite a bit. I was talking about a favorite statue on the last one. One of my favorite singers is Natalie Merchant. So gorgeous. How do they, how did they teach you to be just a happy puppet dancing on a stick? Just a happy puppet dancing on a strings. Is it strings or stick? Strings, dancing on the strings. Anyways, I've had puppets, really nice articulated limb puppets on sticks and on strings. And uh, yeah, that's going to be a theme that we're going to be referring to in our music. And I wanted to actually since, uh, again, at least 2015, I've been working on music that has to do with puppets <laughs> since 2015, just for the record. Right now I'm researching how to make my own charcoal for cooking, but also for filtering water, how to make my own large scale and small scale water filters, and dig my own well, and do all sorts of real serious, serious stuff like that. And I haven't looked up when hummingbirds migrate, but I know it's any day now, or they already have, because I haven't seen them around landing on the little sticks and everything else, the little plants in the garden and the apple tree. It's been a few days, so they may have already done so. That one monarch butterfly, that lonely, lonely one butterfly this year, I haven't seen except for that few days that it showed up, that I caught it on film a couple times, very briefly. So this is a strange year, but yeah, I'm going to be getting rid of the phone that I have the YT on. But I notice when you upload all these videos, the shorts don't count because you just like do them really quick with that app on your phone. But when you do like a real video to upload, there's a lot more checks than there used to be. It's like you got to jump through all these hoops. I'm like, no, I'm not putting cards at the end doing all this stuff. I don't even know if they're going to keep them up here. They're probably going to just erase them, or the only people that are really viewing them are the checkers and reviewers, <laughs> the actual human reviewers that they give me. But I don't want to be too uh, insecure about it. At the same time, I'll keep putting these out there as much as I can. Um, and I'm also going to be cutting stuff out of my life that gives me more censorship because <laughs> that's one thing I need less of that's for dang sure it's time to use my voice box and um, really put a fire under that passion I felt on so so many very important issues I've seen lots of other people doing it so I can too people will see me and hear me so they can too and together we got the power to keep loving each other no matter what happens we got the power to do that we got the power to do that